In what can only be described as a Silicon Valley soap opera, Google co-founder Sergey Brin is separating from his wife amid rumors of an office romance. Brin first met his wife Anne Wojcicki in 2007. The couple has two children and has collaborated on several business and philanthropy projects. A Google spokesperson says the separation was amicable and the two have been living apart for several months. But a reported workplace affair between Brin and an employee working on the company's Google Glass device is adding a dash of drama to the split. Brin's rumored sweetheart is 26-year-old Amanda Rosenberg, five-year Googler and marketing manager for Google Glass. She's reportedly responsible for the glass activation phrase, OK Glass. Rosenberg was previously dating top Android executive Hugo Barra, who recently announced his departure from the company for a job with China's Xiaomi. All Things D reports Barra's exit was not related to Rosenberg's alleged relationship with Brin. But that reassurance hasn't stopped the rumors from flying about what the Sydney Morning Herald terms a potential love quadrangle. It's still unclear what the fallout of all these rumors and reports will be, but Forbes notes Brin's wife has powerful ties to the company, which could shake things up if the separation isn't as amicable as Google claims it is. Wajiki's sister Susan has a powerful job at Google as a senior vice president of advertising. Yet another complication, Google and Brin have invested in Anne's company, 23andMe, which sells home DNA testing kits. And a Bloomberg analyst says Brin's romantic activities could interfere with his credibility as a Silicon Valley leader. He's been a public face of Google, always one of the more kind of idealistic voices at Google. I think it's hard for him to go out, at least for the foreseeable future, and talk about those high-minded things when he does have this, this personal issue. But despite the scandals at headquarters, Google investors have seemingly remained calm. Google's stock price Thursday rose with the rest of the market, and MarketWatch reports three analysts who cover Google say the drama has not affected their view of the company, nor has it spurred many inquiries from their clients. A correspondent for CNBC says the company is used to dealing with sordid rumors about their top brass. Google is used to rumors about uh, uh, top executives, Eric Schmidt. Uh, his marriage has been written about in the New York Times, and, right. and he's seen out and about. Formal divorce proceedings have not been filed, but Brennan Wojcicki reportedly signed a prenuptial agreement. For Newsy, I'm Candace Aviles.